try to show y'all. You don't need Bath and Body Works, but you can come and get these candles right here. For $49, and they smell way better. I like mine upstairs, and you can smell it all the way downstairs. So don't sleep on Audi for your candles. Hey y'all, I'm Kat, and I'm back with another video. As you can see behind me, I'm just now leaving Audi. I did film a little bit so I can show y'all the candles that I think are um, way better than Bob's and Body Works. And I think they're under $5. I did get one. It's 27 degrees out here. That's why I did not film. But I'm on my way headed to Big Lots so I can finish getting some stuff for my beauty room shelves. So if you are interested in this video, keep on watching because after that, I'm going to cook dinner. Din Din. So, see y'all later. When I pulled up, I thought they was closed. Shoot. Okay. It's cold. It's cold, y'all. Let me see if I can find what I'm looking for. I'll talk to y'all in a minute. Going all to different places, different planets Watch your aura pass me by, losing balance What if we were out of time? Okay, y'all, I'm back in the car. I have a serious problem. I went in there with a $50 budget, and I ended up spending $123. But how I tried to justify it is... I'm not sure how I want to set everything up on the shelves. So what I don't use, I will return. So again, do not sleep on Big Lots because I found a lot of cute stuff for a reasonable price. A lot of people like to go to Target, Home Goods, and all of that. So I feel like since everybody got hip to Home Goods, in my city, there's hardly ever anything in Home Goods. So my new place to shop for um, household stuff, like as far as designing your shelves, rugs, different stuff like that is big lots. So I'm about to go home. It's still 27 degrees. It is 7.38 p.m. So I'm about to go home, show y'all what I got. I was going to make some chicken wings for dinner, but I'm not sure how I'm going to feel because in case you don't know, when I'm walking, uh, my lower back starts hurting from all the surgeries that I had. So I think I might end up just 
making some pork chops and some corn or just a pork chop sandwich I don't know but yeah let me get home I got about a 15 minute drive maybe 20 and I'll show y'all what I got okay y'all I'm back at home I'm gonna do a quick grocery haul and then I'll show you the stuff that I bought from our beauty room I hope I don't look cross-eyed because I really can't see y'all this close in these glasses so hold on Okay, this is one of the candles that I got. It's the chamomile green tea. It smells so good. Like I said, if I burn this upstairs, you can smell it downstairs. And I live in a townhome. So try these candles. Huntington Home. For my groceries, I got some spinach, some coleslaw to fry my cabbage, two avocados, two cucumbers, some raw honey, this juice, this orange juice right here, my daughter put me on. We had this for our Christmas brunch. You get it from Audi's, the one with the blue lid. I promise if you drink this, you will not drink any other orange juice. I got two of those. Um, they had some pumpkin spice whipped cream. I got that for my coffee. They had the salted caramel. I got that for my coffee. They also had chocolate, but I didn't want that. I got some fresh cut, cut green beans. I got two of those. I got some butter chicken. We went to an Indian restaurant before. I wasn't a fan. I had to come home and season it, and then it was good. So I got two of those to make my own. I got some real bacon bits. I got two bags of chicken wings. One or two sections, so some is drums. Some is drums, some is wings. I got some green onions for my faux soup. I stopped at Speedway and got some pickles. I don't like generic pickles. I like Velocic pickles. I got a pack of these pork shoulder steaks. That's what I'm going to make for dinner. I'm going to let these soak in some lemon juice and salt. Excuse my nails. I washed my hair today and it stained my nails red. Um, I'm going to let these soak in some lemon juice and salt to clean them while I put these groceries away. And then I got two packs of chicken thighs. I'm going to separate those, freeze those, mark the date on those. And that's all I got from the grocery store. And let me put this stuff away and clean my pork chops. And then I'll show y'all what I got from Big Lots. Y'all see how this water looks? That's why I have salt. Kosher salt. Now let that sit. Now I'll let that sit in there for at least 15 minutes. Then I'm gonna rinse it and season it. But I'm gonna stir it up a little bit off camera. But that's how I clean my pork chops. So y'all make sure y'all clean y'all's meat. We already know we don't know what they're putting in the meat. So make sure you you at least clean it. Okay, I heard my doorbell. Bye bye. Okay, this is how my pork chops look. I'm gonna make this quick. I'm having back spasms. So I'm gonna use fake seasoning, deer weed, olive oil, garlic powder, adobo seasoning, onion powder, total seasoning, and oregano. I'm gonna season the front and the back of these with all of these seasonings. Let them bake for 20 minutes. And I'll show you what they look like when I get done. Okay, they're nice and seasoned on both sides. Now let's stick them in the oven. Okay, they are all done. And I have some pickles and onions. I have some Frank's Red hot sauce, some A1, some mustard. I like green hot sauce, Chalua. And my babe likes Caesar dressing on his. And then I have some Sara Lee wheat honey bread. And this is going to be Din Din. No side dishes. We just having pork chop sandwich. Pork chop sandwich. <laughs> we just having pork chop sandwiches. So let me make my sandwich. I'm going to show y'all what it look like. It's beautiful. 
thick, so I'm gonna have to cut it. Here goes my bread. from the health food store the other day it's supposed to have me sleep i've already used a little of it a little bit of it so far no good then i have this lavender it's a little bit more expensive the first day i put this on i did fall asleep early but i didn't sleep very long i only slept for like maybe two hours so i'm gonna try it again tonight with this one with nature lavender soap so i'm about to get in the shower and see if i fall asleep it is now 9 32 so i'll let you know tomorrow if it works Try to get on a sleeping schedule this brand is called now essential oils and this soap was $4.99 all right, I'll talk to you all tomorrow, and then we'll finally do my haul. Okay, happy Valentine's Day to me. This is all for me. Bag show out. Every time I mention something, it just suddenly appears around here. I better get y'all one of these. A man. And this is what I got for Valentine's Day. This is a card from Babe. Some flowers from Babe. Some roses from my son. Some perfume from my son. Some perfume from Babe. A bear from my son. 
a balloon for my son. And these balloons is from my babe. And since this is the month that my dad passed away, my babe got me some sympathy cards, but I'm not going to show those because they're private. So my Valentine's Day was really, really good. And finally, it is here, the last piece that I needed to finish my beauty room. My babe asked me what I wanted for Valentine's Day. I told him I wanted some shampoo, and I got that. Then he ended up getting me that, um, a bottle of Valentino perfume, as well as he surprised me with my office chair. Yo, I'm going to show you how I choose my perfumes. So during Christmas, I ordered this, and it comes with all of these sample fragrances. So... I went through each one and figured out which ones I like. So, so far, I like this. And that's how I ended up with this that I got for Valentine's Day for my bag. It's a 3.4 ounce. I got it from Sephora. And it's the Valentino uh, Born in Roma Coral Fantasy. And this is what it looks like. Then I got this Jador. It is not on here, but I had got a sample from when I got my babe some cologne from Macy's. And I like the smell, so my son bought me this for Valentine's Day. And I think he got this from Macy's. And this is what she looks like. Isn't she pretty? So this is an easy way for you to add to your collection. Is when the holiday is coming up and somebody asks you what you want. Just tell them you want a bottle of perfume. But since I can't do a lot of walking, it's easier for me to order this and then get the samples. I guess I can open it and show y'all what it looks like. <laughs> it comes with all of these samples. And then as I get the ones that's in here, I'll put them in a drawer. And then see which ones I have left over. So my next ones that I want is the Dolce & Gabbana Light Blue and the Marc Jacobs Daisy. This Marc Jacobs Daisy is so fresh. It smells so good. So the next time somebody asks me what do I want, I'm going to get these two. Then for Christmas, I bought myself the Delina Marley, which they do have a Delina exclusive, but before... I asked somebody for it. I want to go smell it because it's three hundred and some dollars a bottle. But I got the oil. It's the three point three ounce, and I got it from Nordstrom's. But I got the oil because it was a hundred dollars as opposed to paying three hundred dollars for the perfume. And then I have the Delina Marley dupe that I ordered from Okja. So let me get that, and then I'll show you what I plan on doing. So this is the uh, dupe for. This is the, this is the perfume. This is the oil. So if I mix these two together, then I can smell like that three hundred dollar perfume. <laughs> and then I'm gonna go smell the the Delina exclusive, and then that's the one I really want, I think, because they said that one smells the best. So these are my new purchases. I'm gonna put them on my stand, and then you will see them in my beauty room makeover. Also, I was going to get my hair cut off, but my stylist washed my hair during my birthday. So, my babe did end up getting me these Olaplex sets. I got the bomb maintenance shampoo, the bomb maintenance conditioner, as well as the hair perfecter. And this works miracles. My hair felt like straw, and now it feels so soft. So, I'm glad that I went this route before I decided to cut my hair off. And I got this at Sephora as well. And these are $30 a bottle. So, yeah. For my oil diffusers in my beauty room, I got the Summer Scent Collections from Amazon. And then it came with the scents Pina Colada, Coca, Coconut, Strawberry, 
ocean breeze plumera and pina colada y'all these smell so good it's way different from the lemongrass the eucalyptus and all of that i wanted some different fragrances so i will leave these in the link in the description box below And this is all the new things that I got to go in my beauty room as far as fragrances. Okay, y'all, I'm finally back for the haul. And as well as I got some packages in the mail, so I want to share them with y'all. Um, like I said in my last clip, my babe was sick, then I got sick, then he got better. I'm still kind of sick, but I'm like, I got to get this video recorded. So let me get y'all updated on what I got since the last time y'all seen me. So, my bag went to World Market and got my favorite bubble tea. It's in the flavor Honeydew. So, he got me 12 of these. And then, I got the matcha flavor. And then, I just got the bubble milk tea drink. And because I like the Honeydew so much, he ordered me the Honeydew um... It's like a powder, bubble powder. So I'm going to try this to see if, because these are kind of expensive. I think they're almost $3 a can. So I'm going to try to mix this and see if it tastes like this. As well as he ordered me some items off of Timu. I never knew about Timu because Amazon had me in the choco, but now Timu has me by the shirt collar. <laughs> So he ordered these, and then I got online, and I ordered a lot of stuff. I'm going to show y'all that in some later videos. But for now, I'm going to show y'all these. So he ordered me these pan cleaners, because the bottom of my pans look disgusting. And I like them to look like they're brand new out the pack, so I'm going to try to use these. It came in a set of two. As well as he ordered me... Two of these oil spray dispensers. So I'm gonna put clean these and put them up on my where I keep my um all of my olive oils and cooking items. But this is what they look like. And he got me two. I think the packaging is so cute. This is what the top of it looks like. And then I can spray my oil on my food or my salad or whatever. A little fancy, fancy. And then he got me these car air diffusers. It's like little package. This you take this and clip it on your vent, air vent in your car. You open it up. Then you open up one of these. And then you slide it, the cartridge into here. And it has a little clip. I don't know what I did with it. But it has a little clip that you put on the back of here. And then you clip it to your uh, heating vent. You see it's like an oil. And then you put it in your car. And then it'll smell. This is the lavender scent that I just put in here. And then he got me some extra cartridges. So let's see what they are. This is another lavender. This is lemon. This is a fragrance. This one is orange. And this is C Elegance. So these are the refills. I'll put them in my truck when I go outside. I hope I find that little clip. Otherwise, it would be pointless because I wouldn't have nowhere to hook it. Then he got me these little bear-shaped uh, ice cube forms. They're silicone. And they come out, you can make uh, bear shaped ice to be a little fancy when you're making your coffee or if you're entertaining or whatever. And then I'm going to show you what it looks like. So this is the ice cube. 
So this is the ice cube. It comes out in the shape of a bear. And then I got my little shot glass. So I will pour my drink and then sit it on top of there. So it came in two. And you can order all of this stuff off of Timu. Timu, Timu. And I thought that was really, really, really cute. So I can't wait to use that. And then he ordered me a set of five of these coffee spoons to go on my coffee bar. I think those are really cute and fancy. Wake up in the morning, make my coffee. And I don't know. Oh, I found my clip. It was behind me. So, you connect this to this. And then you set it on your, I mean, put it on your vent in your car. So, yeah, that's how that goes. And then, he got me this um, stencil thing that you could make your own stuff on your coffee, some cakes. And you just take this. And you fill it up with um, some cocoa powder. You fill it up. It has batteries already in it. You close it. And then when you put your powder in there, you push this button. And it shoots out your uh, powder so you can draw designs on your coffee. It also comes with this spoon to so you can fill it up. And then... My family says I'm bougie. I just like different stuff. And my bag knows my taste. So he knows what to order me. I never have to ask. He got me all these stencils. So you sit it on top of your coffee mug. And then you just draw out what you want. I am going to do one of these on camera. So stay tuned for that video. Because I'm curious to see how it works. We have a rose, the stars, a happy face, and something else. The sun, another flower, and some more hearts. And then the last item he got me from Team Team U Tim U is a dumpling mode. Now, what he thinks I'm gonna do with this, I don't know. But because I do cook a lot, I like doing different things. Make sure you subscribe because I do a lot of things on my channel. So it comes with these molds. I guess you use these to press out your dough. It comes with two of these. This is what the machine looks like. So I guess after you press out your, uh, your dough, you will put that in there. We're going to figure it out because I'm going to do a cooking video. This is what the machine looks like. I'm not even going to pretend I know what I'm doing because I do not. But he put me up to the challenge, so I'm going to use it. And it also comes with this. So we're going to figure this out together. I do like to cook. If you've been watching my channel, I do have a lot of cooking videos. It comes with the manual. So I guess you take this spoon. I mean this to close it and then you push down and it probably seals it together but it does come with instructions it has a button it's an open unlock device then you put that in there and then you push it down yeah it's, it's kind of self-explanatory so yeah we're gonna make some of these when i get the stuff now let me show y'all what i got from amazon and um, big lots when I went shopping. Okay, since I changed the color of my room, I needed to get a new case for my uh, MacBook. So I ordered one. Let me open it. It looks kind of small. I hope it fits. But I got it in the color blue, of course, because that's what color I'm doing my room. I'm going to try to be on video more often. It makes it more personable. 
but I'm trying to get these videos out so I can be more up to date. Oh, this is for my iPad. This is what this one is for. This one is for my MacBook. So it comes with the cleaner. Of course, I got it color blue and gold. Match my beauty room. As well as it comes with the keyboard covers. And then the instructions on how to put it on. I got all of this stuff from Amazon. If I ever post an item, it'll be in the description box below. If not, you can always comment and I'll be more than happy to share the link with you. But I'll try to stay on top of putting the items in the description box. Okay, we have another item from Amazon. One thing about, if you notice on my channel, I'm always going to find a deal. And I want you guys to be able to shop on a budget and it still looks expensive so with me saying that i ordered these coasters from amazon to go in my beauty room this is how they come they are marble and they are ceramic they're packaged very beautiful well they feel good too and then they have the feet on the bottom, so you don't have to worry about them sliding anywhere. And they came in a set of four. These are so pretty. I can't wait for y'all to see my beauty room. I'm so proud of it. So I got these. And to be honest, y'all, I'd ordered so much stuff. I don't even know what some of this stuff is. Oh, oh, oh. This is a vase that I ordered to style my shelves in my beauty room. I got it from Amazon. Isn't it pretty, y'all? One thing that's not my strong suit is styling shelves. So I'm really trying to take my time and force myself to do it because I know I can. But sometimes I'm we could be over creative and it could be too much. And I don't want it to look like it's too much. I want it to look like it's professionally done. Even though everybody in my family says I need to do interior design for a living. And I think that's a great compliment. But this is the base. And again, I got it from Amazon. I can't wait to get done filming this video so I can go upstairs and style it and let y'all see the finished results of my beauty room. Then I got another package from Amazon. I already have one of these hanging up on my wall in my beauty room. I needed another one. But I paid $19.99 for one, and they wanted $37 for this one. But I only needed one picture out of the set. So, of course, I was like, I'm not paying that. And I just got one for $19.99, and then I have to pay $37 for just one out of this set. And then my babe went on and paid for it. So... It only feel like there's one in here. And I hope it's the right one. Let me see. I hope I don't have to return this. Okay, it's three in here. I was about to cry. Because it said it said a three. But of course, my babe was like, if you want the darn thing, I'll pay for it. I'm like, no. If I wouldn't pay for it, I wouldn't want you to pay for it. We went back and forth. So I ended up getting it. Okay, so basically this is what they look like. You'll be able to see it better once I put it on the wall and have the background. And then you put this in with the screw and it'll, it'll protrude off the wall a little bit and it'll look like it's 3D. So this is the one of a woman hugging her body. It comes with all, everything that you need. Then this one is just the woman figure. This is not the one I wanted. Okay, after long struggling trying to get this out of the packaging, this is what this one looks like. 
And as you can see, it's a woman holding her neck and then the lips up here. This is the one that I wanted out of the whole pack. So I'm going to put this up in my beauty room. So this is the last art picture piece that I was waiting on that I needed. So that is everything that I got from Amazon. What I'm going to do with these two extra ones, I think I might put them in my bathroom to upgrade the pictures in my bathroom. And y'all, I ain't even going to lie. I had to cut the video. I had to edit the video because it took so long to get into the plastic that they wrapped it with. I'm still picking plastic off of it. But it does come packaged very good. So if you're interested in these pictures, like I said, I will link them in the description box. And last but not least, this is my stuff that I got when I went to Big Lots to style my shelves. So... It needs to be wiped off. But I got this black vase. And it was $10. And the brand is Contemporary Kitchen. It's a um, utensil crock. But I'm not going to put utensils in it. I'm going to use it to style my shelves with it. And you can always use items that's used for something else to style your shelves with. Then I got the succulent plant with the gold um, stand. Again, this is the colors that my room is. And it was $6. Then I got this item from the brand Real Living. It says, do good things. This is little affirmations I can look up look at every day to keep me encouraged to keep going with this YouTube thing. And it's a decor tabletop. Like I said, it's from Real Living. And it was $8. Then I got this wooden link chain. And it was $9.99. And this tabletop chain. And it has the dimensions. And it's from Real Living as well. And that's what it looks like when you lay it down. Then I got this wooden sphere. It did not have a price tag on it, but he rang it up for $9. And my design, I'm going to show you how you can bring different textures together and make it all work. Then I got this sign because I'm going to always be me. I don't care what's trending, what's in, what's out, whatever. I don't care. I'm going to always just be me. So I got this. Then also from the real living, I got this. And I can't flip it over because it has these rocks in there. But this was $20. Then I got this sphere. It was made in India. It was, it says handcrafted in India. And it was $7.99. And then I also got this. It was made in India. It was $9.99. And it's a gold sphere as well. And that's one thing about when you're doing a makeover. You can grab this stuff because sometimes when you go... It's there, then when you decide to go back and get it, it's not there. So I always suggest, if you can, just go ahead and get it. And then whatever you don't use, you can return it. Let me move some of this stuff over. I'm about to do my last item. And last but not least, I got this basket. It was, it's from the Bray Hill brand. I love decorating with Bray Hill items. It was $29.99. It was another item that I wanted, but I really didn't want it. And my babe just happened to call while I was in the store. And I was telling him I was feeling frustrated because it's a basket I really want, but it wasn't in my budget. So he cashed out me the money. And I got this blanket basket for my beauty room. And it has the black handles. So it matches everything that I'm doing in my beauty room. 
Like I said, I will link what I can in the description box. And then everything else, you, you will have to go in store or look um, on Odd Lots online to purchase the items. Here is the old chair. Big and bulky, but it did the job. I ain't even gonna stunt, but it wasn't what I needed. And it has all this super glue and all this other stuff on there. So I'm about to get rid of that for this new chair. Okay. I absolutely hate these doors and I have returned the extra can of paint that I have for this room. So I went in the basement and I found some paint. So now I'm about to transform this door that I hate so much. I have a foam roller because this door is textured. And then I just found some white paint in the basement. So this is the before. And then I'll show you the after when I'm done. Breathe in some love and let yourself unfold. Breathe in some love and let yourself unfold. You're so much deeper when you quit paint charades. Yeah. You act so cool, but underneath you seem afraid. Sweet about your eyes when you feel safe. Yeah. You keep running away. Owe it to yourself today. Just try to open up and show some.